I'm Cristina Nerin. I'm professor at the University of Zaragoza. I spent the last 25 years working on food packaging materials, and under this frame, we have developed the Bacto Alarm, which is a visual indicator of the shelf life of food. Bacto Alarm was discovered when we were trying first to find a new antimicrobial substance for food packaging. Then suddenly, when with one of the formula we were testing, the color changed when the bacteria grew. Then we went to study in depth to understand better what happens with this change of color and the microorganism in the, in the plate. Then we realized that there were the metabolites released by the bacteria who react with the formula and produce the change of color. So we decided, okay, this is the base of the new Pacto Alarm. When food is deteriorated, microorganisms grow. This growth produces metabolites which react with the Pacto Alarm and change the color. This means that Pacto Alarm is a sensor or indicator of cell life. The time required for the color change depends on the initial content of microorganisms. When this content is very high, the color changes. From the initial point, which is white or green, then becomes very, very dark, brown, or even black. Back to alarm could be placed on the lid of the tray. For example, in this case, we have put here as an autodesic level. And here we can use as a strip. We produce the concentrated in powder at the University of Zaragoza. Then, once formulated, we send it to the company Samtac in Barcelona, where they put together the formula we supply with some adhesives. The liquid adhesive containing the sensor prepared by the University of Zaragoza and also by Samtac, will travel to Discovery Flexible in the United Kingdom, where they will put it on the packaging material. Hello, my name is Eudal Mas, General Manager of Samtac. Samtac is a European SME located in Barcelona. We produce a wide range of different adhesives. We are specialized in food packaging industry. The 30% of our staff is involved in research and development. Innovation is the first pillar of our development. The relationship with Dr. Cristina Nerin from the University of Zaragoza comes from a long time ago working in different projects. Today, we have Dr. Elena Canellas working at this university as our staff. She develops new applications and makes migration studies. We are involved with IPAC in Back to Alan project, developing and producing the adjusted final sensor to each customer process. We are very proud of the final results we have obtained, and of course, to be part of this great team. Hello, my name is Jimmy Urquhart. I'm the general manager of Discovery Flexibles, based in Dundee in Scotland. We are 150 years old this year and are currently working on a number of industry firsts and patents. That highly innovative history continues today. We've recently made a number of patent applications such as a fully printed ovenable tray and a drinks pouch with an integrated straw. That's part of the reason why we're now working with IPAC AG on a new development. They came to us with a great idea but didn't have a manufacturing solution. We used our innovative past, our innovative skills and our innovative history to develop 
jointly with them a manufacturing solution for Back to Alarm. A key point in the development of the Back to Alarm was to ensure that it was suitable for volume production. To that end, what we've developed is a product that works without modification to packing lines and is suitable for all tray types and sizes. Compilobacter is a serious health issue and is regularly reported on TV and in the press, with over 500,000 cases of food poisoning reported last year in the UK. The beauty of this sensor is that it visibly shows the danger that can't be seen by the naked eye. Discovery Flexibles is very proud to be working as part of a multinational team to develop a product that's suitable for food safety.